Located in the heart of Detroit, the Department of Neurology at Wayne State University and Detroit Medical Center offers a traditional academic mission in a thriving urban environment focused on exceptional patient care, cutting edge research and innovation in medical education. The Neurology Residency is a four-year ACGME approved categorical program. The first year provides residents with a solid foundation in internal medicine. The second year provides an introduction to the fundamentals of neurology in both the inpatient and outpatient settings. Unique to our program is early exposure in the neurocritical care unit. As residents matriculate through the program, elective time is dedicated to the third year to explore the numerous subspecialties available at our institution. The final year allows senior residents to hone their leadership and clinical skills while providing mentorship to their junior colleagues before graduating to go on and thrive in independent practice or continue to fellowships of their choice. One thing that was very important for me that struck me is that uh, I noticed how the residents were getting along with each other and they were very respectful of uh, each other, very professional with one another and also the medical students that work with them. And I also saw how that relationship translated when they work with their attending physicians. So that was something very encouraging and very big priority for me when I was ranking uh, programs. Most importantly, the thing I noticed that was really unique about this program is how diverse the, the training really was. It wasn't just a stroke uh, predominant program. It wasn't just neurocrit care. We had a lot of options, um, whether it's EMG, whether it's neuromuscular, MS, um, headache, dementia, uh, neurocrit care. There's a wide depth and wide scope, and I really believe that's important for us to have an exposure to before pursuing our neuro neurology careers. Yeah, so what I like about this program is we do have uh, different hospital affiliations per se, which means we work at Detroit Receiving Hospital, we see a lot of strokes, uh, we work hand-in-hand uh, hand, uh, with Children's Hospital, so uh, we rotate uh, for pediatric neurology rotations at Children's Hospital. We also uh, rotate at Harper University Hospital in which uh, we see patients from Carmanus Cancer Center, so uh, with the neuro-oncological pathologies and we also see patients at the uh, Rehab Institute of Michigan in which we see patients who are there chronically for therapy purposes. Due to the diversity of this city, and we see a variety of patients uh, with different uh, uh, ethnic background and that also provide a unique uh, the spectrum of uh, clinical and the genetic uh, uh, background that other places do not have. In addition to clinical training, we provide a comprehensive education curriculum covering the full spectrum of clinical neurology. Resident and faculty-led lectures, neurology grand rounds, brain cutting lab, professor rounds, epilepsy surgery conference, pediatric neurology conference, right review, Procedural Skills Workshop, Neurology Internship Bootcamp. In addition to an educational program, we do offer robust mentorship. Our faculty are available to advise residents on uh, career development as well as research projects. Most mentor-mentee relationships develop naturally. A lot of residents gravitate towards certain faculty members based either on personality or based on their uh, clinical interests or their career interests. However, if that doesn't develop naturally, one of the jobs that I have as a program director during our semi-annual meetings or even sporadic meetings is to ensure that the residents do have a point person they can reach out to. During my second year, I had the opportunity to go to AAN um, and I had a poster there. At the same time, I got a, a national scholarship uh, and I participated in this workshop called uh, Future in Neurological Research, where it's dedicated to teach you know, young residents about how to do you know, grant uh, writing or publications or even just you know, finding opportunity to collaborate. So it was a very valuable experience and I had to say I was very proud to represent Wayne State. We have immense faculty support. Uh, the faculty they are themselves involved in research projects and they also give residents an opportunity to come on those projects with them. In terms of my clinical research, I'm allowed to start my own projects. I'm currently working on COVID-19 projects and I'm the principal investigator of my own project, which is a rare opportunity you get in residency and I've been 
The faculty has been very supportive in terms of you know mentoring me. I also get a little bit of lab exposure by uh, visiting Dr. Lee's lab. It is only a short uh, exposure, but for those candidates who are interested in lab, don't be worried when you come here. You can always you know, visit our faculty's lab and uh, if you have interest, they are always very supportive. So you get different kind of exposure here and um, everyone is very supportive of what you want to do. Despite the rigours of residency, our programme works hard to provide training on work-life balance. Our resident wellness curriculum provides support in resident physical and mental well-being, team building skills and ways to have fun in the D. My work-life balance, usually uh, I like to wake up early, that way I'm kind of on top of the patients I'm going to be seeing. Uh, so I'll usually wake up at like 5.30, 6 o'clock and kind of go over the list of the patients I've been following or I will be following. And then, you know, I go through the day, try to get my notes done by a certain time, that way I don't bring work home. And then when I am at home, I like to, first things first, feed my dog, take him out for a walk come back, uh, say hi to my significant other and see how her day was. And then just kind of either, you know, watch a quick show, maybe Parks and Recreation or The Office. Uh, and uh, if I have time, try to fill it in with either reading or go ahead and do a, like a little small DIY project that's been nibbling at me for the past month. Plenty of places are there available in Detroit. We go to Belle Isle, sometimes we do barbecue at each other's place. And when we are bored, we can go out and din uh, have dine at different restaurants. And we have gone for movies, we have gone for parks and different festivals. So there are plenty of things to do in Detroit and we love them to do all together. To me, the neurology program at DMC, it really feels like a big family. You know, my fellow residents, I consider them as my best friends and my attendings, I consider them as my best colleagues. I've really just grown to love and appreciate the amount of diversity um, that we have and the support that we give each other. Our training program is rooted in a rich clinical neurology tradition, coupled with the most advanced and innovative tools in the field. Our faculty is composed of excellent clinicians dedicated to shaping the next generation of competent and compassionate neurologists to practice in an evolving healthcare environment. Our residents are trained to provide care to patients from a wide range of ethnic, cultural and socio-economic backgrounds. We ultimately strive to train future clinicians, future educators and high-impact researchers in the field of neurology and its subspecialties.